there's going to be a school trip to the aquarium, and I need to get a permission slip from a parent. You don't need such distractions. Just focus on your training. All work and no rest won't do him any good. He needs to go out and have fun. What does a UA dropout know about what it takes to be a hero? Stay out of it. <laughs> NG, can we talk in the other room for a moment? <sighs> ah! Ah! I didn't mean to cause trouble. Sh Shoto, and go to the trip. <gasps> Dude, listen, I know that I'm gonna regret asking, but like, are you my dad or just him? <laughs> Your father has a thick skull and a big dick. Both need to be smashed in order to get anything through to him. I will die. Mm. By the way, I got your dad to buy that phone you kept asking for. Mm. Mm. I shall live for another day. Um, so this is my boyfriend, Mirio. Hi, Sensei! Mm -hmm. And that's my boyfriend's girlfriend, Hibiko. Oh. Mm. This is my boyfriend, Kaminari Dunkey. <laughs> And this is my other boyfriend, A-Hole. Well, it was too much to handle, so he got himself an emotional support 1A student. <laughs> okay, so I may have been a bad influence. Eraser, we're asking students and faculty around UA some questions. Please answer with the first thing that comes to mind. Okay, uh, first question. What was the inspiration for your hero name? Uh, Dunno, a friend gave it to me. Oh, that's cute. And who's your personal hero? My paycheck. And, uh, who do you idolize? My dad. Isn't that the evil guy in Tartarus who murders people and steals their quirks? Okay, uh, what's something you're grateful for? Days where I don't have an alarm set. Listen, is this going to take long? I have a class to get to before someone dies or burns the school down. Uh, no, that's all. Thank you. Papa, no kitty! You already have Empress, little one. Dear heart, don't you pout at Papa. <coughs> Please don't cry, Angel. <coughs> Dumb baby tricked by cat plush toy. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone! Today we have a special episode with a guest appearance. I've been instructed not to move due to budgetary reasons. Ahem. So, a factoid about a racer head has been circling for a while. We'd love to hear your side. I'm a pro when it comes to racer heads, so go right ahead. How does it feel to be married to an ace person? Well, it's wonderful, because it's a Razorhead! And are you Ace yourself? Well, I am what a Razorhead calls a... Kinky Bastard. Huh, so you're... into stuff? Very much so. So, how do you deal with it? I have hands, my friend! Have you ever done or considered having special friends to help you out? The mere thought of even looking at someone that isn't a Racer makes my stomach turn. <laughs> 